Time for 96.7 Yes FM Entertainment News. Okay, Corey Feldman uh, is is about to name names. Yeah, he's ready. This he's whole had thing. Enough. He says he claims that a current LA Dodgers employee ran a child's club in Hollywood and was one of the men that molested him. Okay. Uh, Corey Feldman, uh, obviously a child star in the 80s, a little bit past my time, um, but you know he was he was he got his celebrity status at a young age. And apparently he was taken advantage of. He yeah. gave some names during the Michael Jackson scandals in the 90s. Uh-huh. Cops told him it was kind of out of their jurisdiction. Right. Go to the LAPD. Right. He did it. Did. But now he's claiming, you know, once he gets legal representation, he's naming names and pointing fingers. Okay. So, I mean, good for him if that's what's right. And he can, you know, right some wrongs and go ahead. I mean, as long as he isn't going to make money on this. Yeah, as long as yeah, he's not trying like... to exploit things and bring up, you know, right. things just for money. All right. Um, Speaking of money. Yeah, a lot of money. Just to show you what people will do for a payday, Snoop Dogg and DJ Khaled. Yeah, Snoop Dogg, DJ Khaled, $1 million for a private Halloween party, mm-hmm. which is, you know, great, awesome. Oh, Halloween, DJ Khaled, Snoop Dogg, those are some party guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a kid's party. Uh, the Stars with a Z cable TV channel. So Snoop did his clean versions of the song, and the only smoke that there was was probably out of their fog machine. Yeah. Uh, DJ Khaled brought his one-year-old old son, uh-huh. Assad, who's almost probably more famous than we are. Definitely worth more than us. But <laughs> no. anyway, had an extra $1 million to their net worth. Yes, a million dollars. For a private out at kids a, show. A kids party. They dressed as clowns and danced around and sang Kubaya. Whatever it takes for to a make a buck. Heck yeah.